All right, guys, it's Jernigan here. I reckon China are hiding things in their lab over the coronavirus. I imagine, is it other places in the world that are hiding things in their labs of the coronavirus? Could it be across the whole world that are hiding labs across the world of coronavirus? There's like tons of labs in the world, probably millions of labs, thousands, hundreds of thousands of labs. I don't know how many labs they have. Hundreds of thousands of hospitals, millions, same with police stations, same with army bases, hundreds of millions. Everywhere's got places that they can go to. You know, um, I just don't know what's going on. I'm really in, it's like being in the dark, everybody else. Nobody tells us the full story. We're all confused. We want to know what's going on. And they only tell us little bits going by time by time. They only tell us what we want to hear. They don't tell us what we really want to hear. That's how I feel. I'm sure that you guys and girls feel the same way. <clears throat> they call it the Kong flu. They should call it the coronavirus. All these other YouTubers that I watch call it the Kong flu. It's called coronavirus. I mean, just say it's coronavirus. <laughs> you know, um, there's nothing wrong with explaining the truth of what a disease is. They shouldn't be scared of talking the truth. I mean, I'm not scared of speaking the truth of what virus it is. So all these other YouTubers have been saying, oh, it's called the Kong flu. Just say it's the coronavirus, there's nothing wrong with it. You're speaking your way, everyone's speaking their way. If you want to put the word out there and try to make people safe, that's a great thing. If you don't speak up, people can't hear you. So that's what I say. If you speak up, you're heard. If you're not speaking up, people can't hear you. You don't want to be hiding in the corner, curled up in the corner. If you're curled up in the corner, no one can hear you, no one can see you. Show, you, show yourself to be heard, in my opinion then people can understand what you're talking about, about the coronavirus and how it's going to be affecting a lot of people in the world, which we all know it's affecting loads of people. And people just want this nightmare to end. So, I just really don't know what is really going on. We're all confused over this. We're all sceptical. This has really done a lot of damage. Lots of people are very upset for losing their jobs. Lots of people have probably um, done loads of horrible things to other people. They've probably lost their temper with the family. They've probably uh, fell out of the family members. They're probably living on the streets. There's lots of veterans on the streets as well, which should be having homes. But we're helping out all these illegal immigrants and migrants that are coming across the country, and some people will disagree with that. We're all human beings. We all have to fit in at the end of the day to help people. Um, people deserve to be on this earth, in my opinion. Some people say good or bad. But people, we, we've, all of us human beings, we can make a change in ourselves. We can be different. We can, you know, just change, you know. Some people find it hard to change when some, when some people don't know how to change in the world. Just be yourself, don't be anybody different. That's what I say. But oh, there's always somebody in the world that takes people's thoughts and opinions the wrong way, which is not normal in my opinion. I know I changed a bit off subject there because I'm talking about all sorts of things in here, which can be very annoying for the country and, and the world, really. But uh, I'm in very deep thought like all you guys and girls are. None of us really know what's going on. We're just guessing what's going on. The same with these scientists and politicians. They're just guessing second guessing all the time they think you know it's going to end oh the numbers are going to be down lift the restrictions up oh we've got the restrictions back on it's, it's okay now it's never going to be the same even though we would love it to be and want it to be the same you know we've made a big mess and how, how are we going to sort out this mess? That's the thing that a lot of people will be asking. How are we going to fix the problems that have been broken? Because they can be fixed, but over time, the road wasn't built in a day. It's built over many years. So this problem that we're having now with the coronavirus is going to be for many years to come. We all know it's going to get worse. And some people say, oh, no, it won't get worse. It will get worse. Mark my words. And I'm not threatening or being horrible to people, because you know. I'm just telling you the truth and the facts. Some people may not listen, some people may not listen. But the, it is going to get a lot worse. 
for a lot of people. Unfortunately, uh, very worse. As you can see, my TV's just turned itself off. I don't know why it's gone onto the blank screen. It's very uh, annoying when it seems to do that sort of thing. I'm not watching anything. I was watching a bit of the news, even though I'm talking on the phone. So I'm kind of watching a bit of the news on the TV, even though I'm doing a video in here. And some people say, may say to me, Jernigan, that's rude. You should be talking about what you're talking about instead of watching TV at the same time and talking on the phone. How can you do that? I mean, I'm semi watching the TV, but I'm speaking on the phone, looking down the phone at you guys and girls, my subscribers and new people, and trying to talk to you what's going on in this world. We all know what's going on in the world. Some people don't want to hear it, other people do. It's all about compromising the world. People want to listen, some people don't. Some people get rammed down the throat and they don't want it there. Which, remember, that is they get forced fed the knowledge and information of what's going on and they don't want to hear about it, but they still do it anyway. That's how people make the money. That's how people get famous and put themselves out there. You don't have to be famous to do a video, just be yourself. That's all I can say on that matter. It's really, I haven't got a clue about this. But I think we're all mixed up over this coronavirus. It needs to be sorted out. It's going to get, the world is going to get worse, like World War Three is going to come. I keep saying that and other people may agree, may think it oh, never happened. But, you know, keep strong, pull through and you should be alright. Anyway, better go for now. Phone's going to be on low battery. Got to charge it and do more videos again tomorrow or later. Thanks for joining me. See you in the next video. Peace.